Welcome to another Simply Answers Tips and Tricks video. In this edition, we're going to show you how to turn on guided access in iOS 7 to lock down your iPad from any prying hands or if you're letting anybody play with your iPad to where they can't change anything important. So, first thing you want to do is go into Settings. Then when you're in General, right here, as you see I have highlighted on the left, tap on Accessibility. Scroll down just a little bit and you'll see right here in Learning, type Turn on Guided Access, just give that a tap. Turn that on. You need to set a passcode, so go ahead and set a passcode. Now obviously you see an option down here. It's called the Accessibility Shortcut. So basically when you triple click the Home button, when Guided Access is enabled, the sh Accessibility Shortcut settings you have enabled will be displayed. Let's go ahead and turn that on. Go ahead and exit out to the home screen. Let's go ahead and enter an app like iTunes. So let's say you're letting a child listen to some music, watch a video, whatever, and you do not want them to access, exit the iPad or mess with any of the on-screen functions. So triple click the home button. Guided access will present itself. You can do various options with the hardware buttons. So you can make it to where the sleep-wake buttons work or don't, or the volume buttons. You can enable the touch screen or turn that off. You can also turn off motion if you'd like to do that. If there's certain areas of the screen you'd like to disable, so let's say for example we wanted to disable this bottom section, I'll just go ahead and put a circle around that. And maybe some of these functions up here, I'll go ahead and put a circle around that. Go ahead and expand that out a little bit. Then once you get everything set up how you want it, just go ahead and press start. You see these areas down here, are, I'm actually touching them, they're not doing anything. Same thing with up here at the top, but obviously I can do other things on the screen. And then if somebody tries to go out, just press the home button. See it says guided access is enabled. You have to triple click the home button to exit. Do that. It's going to ask for the passcode. So that's what's really handy about guided access. And once you go ahead and enter the passcode, it takes you right back into the guided access settings and you can turn it off and all these settings in your iPad are safe when little fingers are playing with it and you don't want them to be able to delete an app or accidentally buy something when they shouldn't so guided access is handy go ahead and give it a shot use it you can leave it on at all times if you'd like you just got triple tap the home button to um, access it and enable it so um, hopefully that helps you out a little bit if you have any questions, just hit us up on Facebook, facebook.com slash simplymac, twitter.com slash simplymacstore, or drop into any one of our locations, and we'll be happy to help you out there. Thanks for joining us. Hopefully we'll see you next time.